14 Signs of Highly Sensitive Person Our world is not a perfect world there are good and bad. Contrary to kindness, there is also violence. How do you react to any stimulus that shows violence or overexposed to something that makes you uncomfortable? Do you have acute physical and mental responses for any external or internal stimulus? Maybe you are a highly sensitive person HSP. Don't worry, it's not a disease or mental illness or whatever those kinds of things. For highly sensitive person like you, you are a big empath, creative and insightful person. If you are still not sure if you are an HSP person, I hope these signs can help you to really make sure you are an HSP or not. So here it goes. 1. You need a lot of time being alone. It doesn't matter if you are introvert or an extrovert person. If you need to spend your time alone in your own space without any distraction from anything, like your phone, television, internet, or even some text message from your girl, boyfriend. It's very possible that you are a highly sensitive person. A HSP always needs some time to hide from the world after struggling all day. They don't go to parties or any crowded place. 2. You blame yourself even for small mistakes. Do you ever feel so at fault for forgetting your lunch appointment with your colleague? It's bothering you even if they say, it's okay. Or have you ever feel guilty for not giving a cat some food even if it's not your cat? A highly sensitive person is a person with a big empathy. But sometimes this empathy can make them put all the world's mistakes into their shoes. Even for things they can't control. 3. You can't say no. You always want to make other people happy by never rejecting everything they say even if you know they are wrong. You don't like conflict or argumentation. You want this world or at least your world stable, peaceful and stable. Sometimes you need to learn to say, no. Because you have a right to stand on your own thoughts and ideas. 4. You get insomnia during the night. You have this sleep disturbance or really hard to sleep for so many nights. You can't get those problems or something you saw during the day out of your head. You overthink your problems that can cause your insomnia. Even if those problems may be simple problems, but because you consider it as an important thing you should worry about, it can make you can't sleep all night. 5. You can't stand to see violence. A highly sensitive person can't stand to watch violence because it will make them feel ill or discomfort. Even if the violence is not in the real world, such as gore movies, war movies or any movie with violence. Even more if those violence are real such as you saw on the news. If you can't watch any gory, bloody things even if it happens in animal kingdoms, maybe you're one of the highly sensitive person. 6. You absorb other people's emotions too much. An HSP can feel and sense other people's emotions or feelings. HSP can absorb the hidden impression or subtle emotions. They can look into a deeper part of human emotions just by looking at others' facial expressions, gestures, or voice tone. That's why if you feel exhausted because of your detection for people's emotions even though other people seem just fine on the surface, maybe you are a highly sensitive person. 7. You easily shocked for any jump scare. Have you ever seen a cat that is jumpy? Sometimes when we see a cat who is in a silence mode or seems sleepy it can easily be surprised even for a small touch or when you try to call them they jump instead. If you can get shocked or surprised for any stimulus such as car horn, phone ringing, yelling or daily loud sound, there's a chance you are an HSP. This includes not only from the sound stimulus. If you show a jump reaction when somebody touches you from behind for instance, this could be one of the signs too. 8. You hold on to your problems. Can you make up a mindset to let go of some of your problems? Or are you thinking about all of your problems very deeply? For example can you still laugh or move on when you lost your $20 money? Do you think about the money you lost and blame yourself for your carelessness? What your friends say when they tell you to just let it go. If you keep all the small problems in your head, you must be careful of the burden from a bigger one. 9. You worrying about small things. After you finish your shower you go straight to your closet and start to choose today's clothes. When you stare at your clothes, you wonder, what should I wear, is white shirt good enough, how about the weather? Oh, I'm gonna choose the black one. But wait. What if today's gonna be a very hot day, etc. You think very deeply for all the small things and choices. Even the daily small details from top to toe can get you frustrated. 
A highly sensitive person used to think deeply for simple daily things. If you find these signs, try to prepare your choice a night before and stick with it no matter what. 10. Embarrassed to share your weaknesses. You don't want other people to know about your weakness, your sad stories or any vulnerability. You want others to see you as a tough and strong person because you think that showing weakness can bring some bad consequences to you. This can happen from your late childhood experience or past experience when you get punished by the authoritative figure when you cry or when you feel scared. Some of these memories are still fresh in your mind and make you afraid to show these feelings to others. What you must remember is, not every person is the same as the person from your past. If you can't find this kind of person, a professional help will do. 11. Your parents describes you as a quiet and shy kid. When you are a highly sensitive person, you can get overwhelmed easily by your surroundings. When you feel social response or stimulus are getting too much for you, you withdraw from your socials. It's a possibility that your parents saw this earlier and tells you that you have always been this kind of shy person. From your younger age. 12. You get overwhelmed by crowded place. What do you feel when you are attending some crowded place like bars, pubs, parties, concerts or any kind place? If you feel your energy get drained when you come to this kind of place, it can be a strong sign for an HSP. Not just those extreme crowded places. It can also happen when you attend your class or office who are having a lot of things going on in one moment. Do you feel your energy drained and exhausted? For an HSP, a crowded and busy places can make them eventually crash at one point. 13. You have a small tolerance of pain. For a highly sensitive person, they can feel pain easily. Such as injuries, headache, stomachache, and many more. This pain can come from psychosomatics that respond to stimuli you got. When you get uncomfortable, your brain sends some kind of signals that affect your body condition. Your brain told you to rest by giving your body various kinds of pain. This is a normal way of survival that all humans are gifted. But for a HSP, these responses can arise more often than regular people. 14. You can see what others missing. Maybe you will respond, aha. Good news at last. For someone who is categorized as a highly sensitive person, you can see what others don't see. You can see the details where others are missing. This is because your sensitivity is so high so you can see many details. For example, you can know your friends are having some problems only by listening to their voice, or you are the only one noticed when your classmates change their small details of their hairstyle. Are you a highly sensitive person? Highly sensitive person can be seen by some of these signs that can appear in daily life. If you ask yourself are you a HSP, try to remember or make some notes from the sign above and match it with your daily responses especially to the loud or crowded social situations. If you find yourself as a HSP you don't need to worry. Because a highly sensitive person has these advantages where regular people don't. You can always be a good friend who can always understand what other people feel, you are a detailed person who can see the connection of what is missing from the small pieces. A HSP is not a disease or disability. Instead it becomes your advantage and privilege. Be proud of yourself.